Hi guys, my name is Gavin Hewitson. I am the founder of Top of the Inbox. We are a marketing agency that specializes in both email as well as SMS marketing. If you're somebody who needs help with their email and SMS marketing, you have come to the right place. We are currently taking consultation calls. All you have to do is click the link down below. Otherwise guys, please enjoy the video. I hope it helps. And once again, new videos every Monday. So subscribe, like, do everything to keep yourself in the loop and enjoy. Thanks guys. Hi guys, real quick, I'm just gonna show you how to create an opt out email that you can send to your subscribers that prevents them for a period of time from getting promotional emails from you. So think stuff like Black Friday, Father's Day, Mother's Day, any time period where you're gonna be sending a lot of communication and you wanna prevent list attrition and people from unsubscribing just because they get annoyed by so many emails, you give them the option to opt out for that period of time through the use of this campaign. And I'm gonna show you how to quickly do it. So step number one uh, is jump into Klaviyo. And I'm just doing everything via a uh, dummy account here. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna go into the campaigns, create a campaign, select a uh, template if you've already got my templates. But for illustrative purposes, I'm just gonna be using uh, one of the Klaviyo ones. So we click that. And then what we do is within Klaviyo and within the template itself, we have to update the email and the button with the option to click it, which will then update the person's profile. So let me just explain that in layman's terms. This email, imagine it saying something like, hey, opt out, opt out for uh, BFCM, okay? Opt out for BFCM and then this button will say, uh, you'll have some description down here that'll say something like, hey, would you like to opt out? If so, just click the button down below. And then this button will say something like opt out. And then you have to insert a dynamic uh, link into the link section here as well. And I will add that link in the description of the video. Now, what does that look like? So the link looks like as follows. It goes update property link. And then here, this one has Mother's Day opt out, but for the purpose of this video, we are gonna make it uh, a Black Friday opt out. So black underscore Friday. Important to use underscores if you do wanna have a space, uh, just space bars won't work. And then what we're gonna do is after that, we're gonna update their profile with true. So right after you add the property, there's another two quotation marks and we're gonna add true to there, okay? And so what that'll do is it'll update their profile property with the Black Friday uh, equaling true. And then after that, you add a redirect link and this will just take them to, for example, a page, a uh, success message saying, hey, uh, so a success page on your website that'll say something like, hey, you have successfully opted out for Black Friday, Cyber Monday communications, or depending on the promotion, Father's Day, Mother's Day communications, all that jazz. So you just chuck that in there and then you hit save. Now, after that, what will happen is once this email goes out, people will opt out, click it, and all their profile properties will be updated. What you want to do is you want to create a segment that comprises of people who have opted out for this campaign. And so what you do is you go, uh, name your segment just up here and you create it and define it as follows. Properties about someone, make sure it equals the property that you've added into the button link, right? So it's, uh, in this case, it's black underscore Friday and it shows up in the custom properties here for me because I've actually already updated an account with this tag. So it just shows up there. But then it goes uh, there, Black Friday, and then is true because I've added true, right? Is true. And then we go update segment and you'll notice that I will be in this segment. I'll show you once it's ready to load. Look, there I am, woohoo. And then when you go to send your campaigns, right? You send it to your engage database here and then you don't send it to anybody who has opted out for those specific types of campaigns. And that is how you create an opt out segment. Really easy, super powerful, great in preventing 
unsubscribes, spam complaints, and uh, super useful coming into the Black Friday, Cyber Monday period, uh, as well as just any time Christmas, where there's just a lot of emails that are being sent. It just prevents subscribers from seeing you as uh, over communication, inundating them with messages and just like somewhat annoying. Anyway, guys, I hope that helps. If you need any help with your overall email marketing strategy, you guys know what to do. Uh, click the link down below. We are currently taking consultation calls. Once again, every Monday we post videos. So subscribe, like, stay in touch, and we'll see you guys uh, in the next one. Cheers. Bye.